Hey guys, sorry we couldn't go to the uh, anime con that we're supposed to go to at the end of the year, but we did find out that here at Chibi Anime Cafe, they're having a holiday party. So we decided, why not have some fun, come see the people that are just like us, and have a good time, and do some trivia together. Come on inside, let's see what they got. Hey guys, and again, thank you for joining us and welcome to Chippy Anime Cafe. We're doing a holiday party and we're going to be talking to some of the people here and see what got them into anime. Join us over here. And what's your name? Patricia. And who are you going as? I'm Dobby from My Hero Academia. That, that is actually pretty cool. So are you going to set me on fire? <laughs> okay, that hurt. <laughs> so, what got you into anime? Um, basically, a lot of my friends got me into anime, but like, I've I watched uh, Soul Eater for my first anime. Yeah, my friends like showed me that anime and I was like, this is really cool. And then I started watching a little bit more. I went to on to uh, Black Butler, then I went to Blue Exorcist. So you like free stuff? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Alright, here you go. Primal Alert, guys. Oh, and cool. inside you got about 30 stickers of anime, some other stickers in there, it's all for free. And we just want to say thank you again for loving anime, joining us and answering a few questions for us. I do have one other question. Yes. So are you a My Hero fan? Yes. What is Midoriya's, what is his catchphrase? Mm -hmm. One for all for Kai! Here we go guys, you heard it here first. Alright, so right here we have... Alexis. Alexis. Who are you right now? Hawks. Well, not really. Not really Hawks? No. It was just Close. part of the jacket. I like it. I like it. So what got you in the anime? Uh, Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon? Sailor Moon. Wow. That's an old school. I watched Sailor Moon when I was like Saturday morning cartoons like 8 in the morning when I was a kid. Yeah, I'm really old. I should not be wearing this outfit. <laughs> so a Sailor Moon fan, who was your favorite character from Sailor Moon? So Sailor Moon? Yeah. What other animes are you a big fan of? I'm starring Naruto. Oh, you can't yeah. go wrong with that one. Okay. Hey, thank you for answering questions. Oh. And here you go for Primal Nerds. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Next up, we have... Aaliyah. Aaliyah. Who are you? Himiko Toka from My Hero. From My Hero. <laughs> so do you like to tamper with other people's blood? No, not really. Yeah, she is cool. She's like a human vampire. All right, so what got you in anime? Um, I have to say Tokyo Ghoul. Oh, Tokyo Ghoul. Okay. Oh, Tokyo Ghoul, yes. I actually have to admit, I have not seen much of it. I've only seen like the clips of it there, like the fight scene. What are you watching currently right now? Black Butler from the last season. That's the second person. I have not. Somebody has got to teach me about but Black Butler. I have not seen it. The only Butler I know is Alfred. So you are a fan of my hero. Yes. Is she your favorite character, or do you have another one? I have another one. Who's the other one? Here we go. Wait. Well, thank you again for uh, joining us and answer some questions. And here's some free swag. And here we have Haley. Haley, I know who you are, but I want to hear from you. Who are you? Shout out Todoroki. I don't know why, but. It's my more festive because I stole Santa hat from my brother. You did it yourself? Uh, yes. So is he your favorite character from My Hero? No, I gotta say Bakugo. I don't know why. Oh, Bakugo. Because of like fiery anger and just cool looking hair and gauntlets that look like grenades. Can't go wrong with that. What got you in anime? My friend Andrew forced me to watch Assassination Classroom. What a good friend. Yeah, I was forced to watch Akira in the theaters when it first came out, and it grossed me out the first time I watched it. Anyways, uh, <laughs> what are you currently watching right now? Uh, Don't I say Black Butler. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole different story. I have too many animes to watch. Yeah. Uh, I have three episodes left on Haiku on Netflix, or not Netflix, 
uh, Hulu, and then I can only, that's all the seasons there. I started Fairy Tale, haven't been watching that. Started Sword Art Online, rewatching oh. My Hero Academia with my parents. It's, it's a long story. It's just <laughs> So what you're saying is quarantine's very been very good to you, is what you're saying. Sure. I mean, <laughs> if gaining like 20 pounds is good, sure. Yeah. We like to thank you for joining us and answering our questions, and we hope to see you again here soon. Cool. <laughs> All right, here's some free stuff. Yeah. Hey, no applause room. Thank you. How are you guys doing? Who do we have here? Well. My name is Ken Brown. This is my youngest daughter, Mackenzie. And our characters right now, we're Doctor Who. I'm as the ninth doctor and I have her as River Song. Here we go. That is actually really, really cool. Yeah. Uh, again, showing my age, I watched Doctor Who, one of the original series back in the 80s. Those are the ones I used to watch with my dad. That's actually how I got into like a bunch of like nerd stuff like Star Trek and everything else. What got you guys into anime and that kind of culture? Back in the 90s, and I'm about to give my age with this one, <laughs> I actually watched specific shows, like one of them was M.D. Geist, and another one was this one, it's like a mystery show called There Were Eleven. You can actually pull it up, it's an older one, like this kid, his name is Tata Lane, and he has this weird sight psychokinetic ability where he can tell somebody's telling the truth or not and it's all about space academy and the reason it said there are 11 is the space academy is very strict only 10 at a time and now Mackenzie what is your favorite show or anime that you're currently watching right now Right now, I like watching Full Metal Alchemist. Oh, here we go. <laughs> you, just, you just made best friends just now. What now? What got you into anime and this kind of culture? Well, I kind of just started watching my dad like watch anime and stuff, and I just started getting into it like that. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, that's that's awesome. a good dad. <laughs> <laughs> well, we would actually like to say thank you for joining us and giving us your uh, answering our questions and everything. And without further ado, you guys get to go away with some goodie bags. Yay! And we'll that's cool. All right. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, guys. All right, now. Now, who do we have here? Steven. Steven. Who are you dressed as? Uh, Ruby Rose from um, Ruby. That is really, really cool. I love the outfit. So, what got you in anime? Sorry. Uh, what really got me in anime was my sisters introduced me to Pokemon when I was about three years old. And then from that point on, I actually started watching anime my, most of my life. So, did you get into the card game or just the show? Just a show. You I saved had, a lot I, of money. What are you currently watching right now? Uh, right now, I'm currently watching um, uh, anime on Hulu called Kuma Kuma Bear, which is the newest one. Um, I'm also watching um, Rent a Girlfriend, which is that sounds funny. familiar. That one does sound I Rent a Girlfriend. One. Rent a Girlfriend. Yes. That one's I think I, I think I've heard of it. Sounds familiar. Yeah, there's there's so many. Rent a girlfriend. So there, yeah, there's there's so many. So, what is your favorite anime ever? Of all time, it's Card Catcher Oh, yeah, uh, that was actually on TV here. Yes. A, 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 on Saturday. I was yeah. five when I, I actually had a crush on Sakura when I was five. So that yeah, that was uh, that was uh, uh, like the Saturday morning cartoons. I actually remember watching that. I do remember watching. It. I was already in the military watching it as an adult. Don't judge me, folks. Don't judge me. It was an anime. I watched it. I don't care. It was Back in my day. It was Card Captor. So we do appreciate it. Thank you for answering the questions. We actually have something for you. <laughs> you pulled me. All right, thank you. So thank you. Yay. Does anybody else want to... Yeah, why don't you get up here? No. Okay. Mm -hmm. And here we have... Uh, Maya Lopez. Maya Lopez. Round of applause, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Applause for you. Ah, there we go. So, what got you in anime? I guess how I got in the anime, I think the first ever anime I ever saw was probably Pokemon, but I didn't understand anime, anime at that time, because so, I was like, why are their mouths moving like that? It's not even, like, it's not even synced with yeah. the words they're saying. Too but short. I think, I don't know, I, I think I, maybe two or three years ago, I might have gotten into anime, I think, so. And what were you watching? 
Um, well, currently I'm watching several animes trying to finish them, but I am currently trying to finish, at least I'm mostly into Mike Butler, <laughs> and, uh, and I'm trying to, I've mostly been watching uh, Haikyuu on Netflix. And that, that's the volleyball one, right? Yes. I have not seen that. I've seen a lot of stuff about it. I want to see it. It looks pretty cool. I, I've never been one a fan for the sports animes, even though I'm like a huge baseball fan. I remember there was like a really cool baseball anime. I remember seeing it, but I've never watched it. So, so you're currently watching Haikyuu. What's your favorite? My favorite... I mean, I guess you would count as a Western anime, but my favorite has to be Avatar The Last Airbender. Uh, okay, okay yeah, that, that one is good. Okay. Acceptable. Hey, but first, when you said Western, I was either thinking of Trigun or I was thinking of Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, me too. Same thing. In this case, yeah. Space Cowboys, man. That's cool. Three. This is awesome. <laughs> so, I'd like to say thank you for answering your questions and joining us tonight, and you get some free stuff. Yeah, fun. <laughs> Thank you. Yay! You don't want to be on? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about in Okay. Does anybody else want to answer any questions? Get free stuff? Yeah, we can cut right now. Guys, again, thank you for joining us and seeing this awesome place here in Moore, Oklahoma. Again, it's Chibi's Anime Cafe. You come here, you can get all your tasty treats, your drinks from Japan, and watch some anime and read some manga all you want. This place is amazing. The people are nice. And as you can tell, you have a really good time with some really amazing people. So the next time, if you're ever in Moore, Oklahoma, be sure to check out Chibi's Anime Cafe. All their stuff is in the description below. And again, thanks guys for joining us. We'll see you guys next time. Later, nerds. Yep, good enough.